Hello, this is Calumly10, and today I'm going to be giving you a review of my Abec 11 Free Rides. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm going to be a review of these wheels. Um, quick specs, these are the um, ones I'll be reviewing today are actually the 72mm ones um, and the 81A. These wheels also come in multiple different sizes. I'm not quite sure what all the sizes are. I think they're like 72, like 70 something and 77. So those, like 74 maybe, I don't know. <clears throat> Check that out on the Abic 11 website. Um, they also come in two different Duros, which is 82, I mean not 82, 84 and 81. So, yeah. But today, I'm just going to be reviewing my, the smallest one, the 72 millimeters, in the 81A. Alrighty. So, let's get started. Just, next thing, is, um, they are offset. Um, so that means that the bushing mounts in the side of the wheel, like, in, kind of in the middle, but not really, kind of towards the side a little bit more, but not exactly in the middle. Um, they also have super rounded lips, which you cannot see very well, because mine are really worn down, but yeah. Their lips are super, super rounded, which makes it really nice for sliding. Um, the offset bearing placement um, makes it pretty slidey and pretty mid kind of durable. Um, like It's kind of slidey because it's off to the side and close to the center, but then it's still pretty durable because it's, cause it's so close to the center, so it doesn't completely wear in the inside as much as a cone as quickly as a side set wheel would. Um, yeah. Um, these wheels are made with the uh, classic urethane. They also have retro free rides which are made of reflex urethane. But uh, I suggest you get these. Um, yeah, because the, the um, reflex formula is kind of grippier than this and when you have a free ride wheel with a grippy rear thing, it doesn't really work out that well. So, if you're going to go want a free ride, definitely go with an ABEC 11 free ride. Um, go, uh, I don't know when you'd ever want a uh, retro free ride, but yeah, those do exist if you would still want one. So, um, yeah, the urethane, they use the classic formula, formula urethane, which is honestly some of the best urethane I've ever ridden on. Um, it's super smooth riding and this uh like this rolling. They roll so smooth. It um since they're they are eighty one A, which is relatively soft, they ride they just roll amazingly. Like they feel so nice. You don't really feel the the uh pavement under you that well. Um but the other great thing is is that they are a little grippy, not the grippiest urethane ever though, they're a little drifty. Um, so you do have a chance of sliding out, especially with this wheel shape, um, just because it's a free ride wheel, you will slide out probably with the, with the urethane and wheel combination, wheel shape combination. Also, um, but what's great about this free ride shape and this urethane that it, since it has such a rounded lips, it, um, slides so smooth, like, literally the iciest, smoothest slide I've ever been on, on a wheel. The 84As are a lot icier than these 81As, um, but yeah, I like the 81A feel better just because they give you a little more grip, and they're not quite as icy as the uh, 84As. But yeah, the 81A has a really, really smooth, really predictable slide that's really good. Like, but my favorite slide ever. Um... Yeah, the um, other great thing about this uh, urethane that it leaves huge thane lines. Like, the thane lines are pretty massive. Like, I mean, they're not as big as you may think they are, because these are, like, that's one thing that these are wheels are known for, is how big their, ur their thane lines are. But, I mean, when you first get them, they won't leave thane lines just like any other wheel. But once you start wearing down and doing long slides with your weight on your wheels, they will... You leave big old, big old, bright, thick thane lines, nice and long too. Um, yeah, so that's a great upside to these wheels. 
Um, Thane line, once again, if you don't know, Thane lines don't really even affect how the wheel slides at all. It's just something to look at. It looks cool and everything. Um, another great thing about this urethane is that it's super durable, too. Um, like, I've had these wheels for, I think, a couple weeks. Um, and they, yeah, they only one wheel flat spotted really bad. The other three did flat spot one. Okay, one wheel got flat spotted really bad and it's almost cord. And that's why I'm not really riding it that much. Uh, one wheel is just flat spotted. Um, one is like deformed. And then one's perfectly fine. And one's, yeah, the other one's just coned. So, I mean, all in all, that's extremely durable compared to the other wheels uh, I've been, I was riding last, which are my zombie hogs. These are extremely durable compared to those. Um, and, yeah, I mean, they're just really nice, durable wheels. The only thing that's kind of weird about it is when you flat spot it, as you can see, it gets like, the only weird thing that happens with these wheels when you flat spot them, it's like flat spot and then this huge bump right next to it. So, it's like regular flat spot bump regular. So that kind of makes it feel even weirder as you're uh, riding these with a flat spot. But, I mean, you can get over it. You can round them back out if you wanna. Um, yeah, I mean, I flat spotted these wheels and um, I got this far into them in about uh, two or three weeks, which is pretty good, I guess. Um, the zombies didn't last much over two weeks at all. But, um, yeah, these wheels are really good wheels. Definitely my favorite, um, free ride wheels. Um, Epic 11 does have some, a new version, which is the 77 millimeters and, like, um, 77 millimeters and their, but their center set. So that'll make them a little more durable, I guess. But yeah, um, yeah. So basically, in recap, they are um, super, um, super smooth slide, icy feel. Um, not kind of, not really grippy because they're really slidey. Um, they have a nice consecutive, like regular wear pattern except for when you actually start to flat spot them then they get kind of janky but if you don't flat spot them they wear really really can like normally um and relatively durable so yeah um if you're looking for any free ride wheel i definitely recommend ebec 11 free rides over just about any other wheel in the competition so, yeah, that's about it. Goodbye. I love you.